If Lord you are my shepherd, what shall I? Lord, what shall I want? Lord, what shall I need? Lay me down in pastures, close my eyes. Lord, you satisfy even while I dream. You restore my weary soul. And in shepherd and I'll follow your command. Yes, you're my shepherd and I'll follow your command. Jesus, you're my shepherd and I'll follow your read that psalm together, Psalm 23. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He 
restores my soul. He guides me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You have anointed my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and loving kindness will follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Isn't that cool? Isn't that good to know? So you've sung those words and you read them and you've heard them. So let's respond to them as we just chill out for a minute. Let's allow the Lord to, to overwhelm us with that truth. I like where it says, he makes me lie down in green pastures. And if you're like me, I don't like to rest. I'm busy. I've got a lot to do. I've got four children. But a lot of the times I allow myself to get in the way of what God wants to do. So allow, allow him to come in and give you rest tonight. So... In the stillness of this room, just close your eyes and let those words just move from your head into your heart. some of us are tired some of us are overwhelmed it's been a crazy week already in some of our lives and our schedules but God I pray that right now you would bring us into your presence and into your fold so that we can rest in all of our troubles our sorrows our pain our struggle God I pray that you would just deliver us right now Give us that sense of freedom once again. And Father, I pray right now that you would drive us to repentance as we examine our hearts for any sin that might be in there that we haven't confessed. God, we give you all that we are. And God, I pray that tonight would be a night of surrender where we lay down all of our junk before you, but also rejoicing, I pray that we would remember who you are, that you created the heavens and the earth, yet you still love me. Remind me how tiny I am, but that you love us. We 
you're so blessed to be called your children. And I pray that if even if there's anybody in this room that doesn't feel your presence or doesn't know that you are Lord, I pray that you would move on them and soften their hearts. We know that today is the day of salvation. And our time is short. So tonight we worship you.